एवरीवन आई एम ईश्वर अरोड़ा एंड वेलकम बैक टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल दिस वीडियो इज फॉर यू इफ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड इन परस्यूइंग a course on vocational studies from university of delhi yes you heard it right this video is for the students who are inclined in pursuing vocational studies in this video we are going to discuss the eligibility criteria that you need to fulfill in your cvt examination in order to appear for this course from university of delhi also we'll be discussing the college that offers these great courses i have made this video in two parts under part a the eligibility criteria does not require maths so yes it is for the students who did not have maths in their 12th grades but are interested to pursue any bachelor course in vocational studies so yes even if you don't have maths you have such options open for you in part 2 under this same course under vocational studies there will be two courses that are that primarily involves that you should have maths with you in your 12th grade so this part one is for the students who did not have maths no issues you can pursue this course first let us see what are the bachelors in vocational study courses as in you have b vocational in banking operations you have b vocational in healthcare management you have b vocational in printing technology and you have b vocational in retail management and it in order to pursue these any of the one you do not require maths for sure that is agar aapke pas maths hai koi baat nahi but maths is not compulsory over here now let us see the eligibility criteria un charo ke liye eligibility criteria same hai kya hai they have given you two combinations combination 1 and combination 2 you need to pick any one of the two now the combination 1 says that you should have any one language from list a any two subjects from list b1 any one subject from either list b1 or list b2 this is what combination 1 has to offer in a couple of seconds i'll be showing you list a and list b first let us see what is combination 2 offering us combination 2 is saying that you should have any one language from list a any one subject from either list b1 or list b2 and section 3 of cuet so let us see list a and list b first and then see now list a basically incorporates all the languages that we have Now in your twelfth grade, suppose you had two languages, say English and Hindi. So you need to pick any one language. But mind you, you should have that particular language in your twelfth grade. No matter your choosing subject, sorry, you no matter your choosing subject from list A or from list B, you need to pursue that particular subject in your twelfth grade. Now. in your list b what are they saying is that you should according to combination 1 what you need to do is that you need to pick three subjects from here two can be from b1 and one from b2 or all three can be from b1 but two necessarily have to be from b1 list b1 incorporates all the core subjects that you might have in your 12th grade say you're from humanities background and you have subjects like english pol science economics you have history and say you have physical education so english you have chosen as the language from list a from list b what you can do is that you can either choose say you can either choose political science and geography and take physical education from list b or what you can do is that you can take all three from b1 that is geography political science and history so three from b1 or two from b1 and one from b2 and one language that is what combination 1 says combination 2 says that you need to choose one language from list a sorted as before from list b they are saying that koi bhi ek subject utha lijiye चाहे B1 से उठाइए चाहे B2 से उठाइए आपकी मर्जी सी आप बहुत प्रो है फिजिकल एजुकेशन में बॉस लीजिए ना किसने मना किया है आपको सिर्फ फिजिकल एजुकेशन का पेपर देना है जाके इंग्लिश का पेपर देना है लैंग्वेज में फिजिकल एजुकेशन देना है बट 
तीसरी चीज जो आपको देनी होगी वो होगी सीयूईटी का जनरल टेस्ट अब जनरल टेस्ट में क्या है जनरल टेस्ट में आपके पास है क्वांटिटेटिव मैथ्स दैट इज मैथ्स अप टू क्लास टेंथ यू हैव लॉजिकल रीजनिंग एंड स्टफ लाइक दैट सो इफ यू थिंक दैट यू आर प्रिटी कंफर्टेबल इन दिस करंट अफेयर्स क्वांटिटेटिव लॉजिकल रीजनिंग सो यू कैन गो हेड विथ कॉम्बिनेशन टू बट इफ यू थिंक नो यू हैव वेरी श्योर विद योर डोमेन स्पेसिफिक सब्जेक्ट देन प्लीज गो विथ कॉम्बिनेशन one but mind you all the subjects you choose either from list a or from list b should be there with you in your 12th grade that is the only condition they had now let us see the only college that offers this great number of courses so the only college that offers this is basically just a second Yes. So the only college that offers this course is Rama Nujan College. So Rama Nujan College is the only college of University of Delhi that offers these four great courses, wherein maths is also not mandatory. So bachelor's in vocational studies in banking operations, bachelor's in vocational in healthcare and management, bachelor's in vocational in printing technology, and bachelor's in vocational in retail management and IT. If you are interested in any one of these courses, then please fill the CUET form right away and enroll yourself. For any more queries, if you have, we are there to sort it out. Stay tuned to our channel for more updates. Thank you so much.